asking for whatever message we need for our highest good for this day. Frolic, dear one, frolic in your day. Step into your humanness, knowing the energy is all around. Blending the experience, bringing your inner child into the frolic. Blending that energy, the energy of the emotion that comes, the communication that comes from the emotion of the inner child, bringing it into your day and feeling the awe and the wonder and the joy. Facilitate the perception of her watching your day, glorying in your day, having fun and joy and sensitivity to the emotion throughout your day, knowing she is getting safer and more comfortable coming in to your experience, helping you on your journey. Dear one, sense her presence Acknowledge her, shine the light of the shared joke, the shared knowing between you and that which is her. Oh, I see her right here with me. Thank you, sweetheart. Thank you for being here. I know. It is glorious, is it not? Ariki. as glorious for anyone who ever hears it as it was for me. I feel my inner child. I feel tears behind my eyes. This last week has been remarkable and it started with the hurt from those unkind comments and it made me turn to her with a strength and a knowing that I hadn't practiced up to this point. And I felt the feeling through her. I felt her sadness and her upset and I let her be sad and I held her. I held her. And it's almost like she and I crossed a bridge together. I can feel her presence now. And hear the communication from her. That sweet, sweet little girl that just wants to play and have fun. <clears throat> dropping into my mind that is that beautiful energy that is the creative force of all that we desire that when we are sitting in the awe and the wonder and we feel the love because it is that little girl that wants to be loved that isn't quite right there's no experience of love like through the eyes of that little one that snuck in and 
feeling, that feeling, knowing all is well, that there's nothing more than this moment right now, and that you're held in the arms, that you're held, that you're held in the arms, and that's the end of the sentence, and we are all held in those arms, we are held in those arms. The arms of the Father, the arms of the All, the arms of the One. The words don't matter, but we are held in unconditional love. And it's our inner child that's going to help us to feel it and revel in it and know it, that it's ours always. That there's no hurt, there's no external circumstance that can separate you from that. That no matter what is going on in your life, and I know some people are struggling so, and I'm so sorry for that. And I, I wish I had a magic wand and I could wave it on this earth. But the only thing I can shine on this earth is my love. I can shine that love and we all can. And we can shine it on ourselves. And we can shine it into our world. And the more we shine it together. And they're showing me my arms reaching out across timelines and dimensions and realms. And incarnations. The more we shine it together with our hearts joined we are making a difference in the world in this moment in the solitude of just the relationship between me and me i am shining this light into the heart of the all every human that walks on this planet is an aspect of me. Every being who has lived or is living is an aspect of me, of the one. Every single being. And when we can sit in that knowing and just love, just love, knowing that the acts of kindness and care and compassion and thoughtfulness that we do for ourselves, we do for the all. It is so overwhelming. I just, in my mind, I can see waves going out from all of us, waves just going into our world a world that we've thought up to this point that we were helpless to change. We're not helpless. We have the answer. We have the answer. And it is within us, each individual. Oh, my goodness. It's so completely overwhelming. Oh, any time we can just shine our love, shine our love on ourselves. Yes, with your hands, Kelly, just like this, loving the woman that you are with all your faults, with everything that's wrong with you that you see through your human eyes that we see as perfect, that we see as perfection, perfection in this moment. There is nothing greater to share than to love yourself, to see the beauty through the eyes of God. God didn't make any mistakes when he created anyone. It is all perfect through the eyes of God. Each one of us are perfect. 
There is nothing we have ever done that has taken us away from this grace. There is nothing we can ever do that will remove us from this grace. I feel in my heart the energy of every person who will ever hear this recording. I know we are one. I know that we are brothers and sisters, that we are a family, that we are one. And we are on this journey to remembering, remembering all that we are. It is so freaking magnificent. Oh my goodness. Oh. Love, 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 love. Love, 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 appreciation. Gratitude. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And with that, I think I'm going to take my little girl and I'm going to go have a fabulous day. And I hope you all do too. <laughs>